This mechanical comprehension practice test question for the ASVAB and PyCat says, after the crank turns 3.5 times, what will be the position of the piston within the cylinder? So in order to answer a question like this, we have to rely exclusively on the information that's given to us in the diagram. More specifically, the first thing I wanna point out is that when the crank is in this position here, this is our starting position. And as you can see in this starting position, the piston is halfway between the top and bottom of this cylinder. Now this crank rotates in a circular motion. So when the crank is at this position here, it pulls the piston to the top of the cylinder. When the crank is in this position, the piston is gonna be in the same exact spot as the starting position. And when the crank is in this position, the piston is gonna be at the bottom of the cylinder. It should be pretty obvious that after three rotations, after three rotations, the piston is gonna be right back in its starting position. So now we have to account for a half of a rotation because according to the problem, we wanna know its position after it rotated, not just three times, but three and a half times. So half of a rotation puts us right here. The crank's in this position. And as I just mentioned, that means the piston is gonna be in the same spot. So the answer to this one is C, same spot.